Alright guys, welcome to this and to another episode of the Timmy Show. Um they posted some photos on uh, Moms today, but uh I went to uh uh, books a million and uh, they have a few of these packs left. Um, I bought one of them I think there was three in their total. So they got two left But uh, it is unstable the uh, three booster draft pack um, And I really wish I was using this on a draft, but uh, we don't have anything going on this weekend. So um, Just wanted to show you guys uh, kind of what they look like but uh comes with three packs and um We'll go ahead and uh, open them up. And uh, the, like I said, you could get these at uh, Books A Million. They cost like $12. And uh, you get three packs. All of them show gobos on the front. All of them come with a foil. Uh, later tonight we'll be uh, I'll be uh, opening up an entire box of uh, unstable, which there's been known to have uh, God packs in them um, or God boxes. All the all the lands are foil. Don't know if we could get, look at that. So we get a planeswalker, the only planeswalker of the set, and uh, there you go. Urza's. Academy Headmaster. Got that one. And uh, Full Art Mountain. And Full Elemental. Couple of contraptions. Both common contraptions. We'll uh, stick the uncommons here. Comes there. All right. Next. Magic word. I seen that on the uh, the loading ready run. Uh, I like that one a lot. Um, another mythic we got uh, some in the pack so opened up two mythics and two packs that's nice full art mountain that's nice our contraptions hey we got a storm crow yeah and once again two common contraptions Last pack. So so far not too bad. We got a the planeswalker of the set and another mythic. Uh work a double. Wow, I see looks like we might have two foils in here. So maybe one's a foil land. Hopefully it is. Spell suck. Hmm. And our rare is a uh, serpentine augment card. And four swamp. Got a mythic. So three mythics and three packs. Hard hat area. And that's a really good contraption. And a foil rogue. And division table. Alright. So you could buy these packs. Um you could get the uh the uh draft pack at uh books a million for uh right around I think it's eleven ninety eight. So your tax comes to about twelve fifty or so. And uh and this one we didn't get too bad. I wish this was a foil land, but it's not. 
but it's uh, still pretty good because uh, everybody likes the uh, <laughs> counter. Spell suck, but um, and uh, I really do enjoy the uh, the full art lands. Um, actually, I love. Everybody knows I love playing with uh, forests and uh, plains. I would have loved to got either one of those, but I want to get playing in the uh, the unstable box that I'll be opening a little bit later tonight, and uh, you guys get to see that. But uh, hopefully, you enjoyed the video and uh, opening some of the uh, the draft pack. And it seemed like it was uh, the draft pack was pretty loaded. Um, so uh, I will be. Um, for this, I everybody knows I hate I hate cube. I hate playing uh, cube. I think cube is something that you typically play amongst friends or or you know well definitely amongst friends. But like when you're waiting on a tournament to start or something like that, you break it out and play it. Um, and uh, for me, I don't quite enjoy it that much. But for my one time in my lifetime history. Um, I, I am making a cube of uh, all the unsets. Um, I actually already purchased um, the commons to uh, unhinged and unglued. I got the complete sets of those. Um, I'll be getting it with uh, unstable with the box. And uh, I or already got all the uncommons um, from Star City the other day. And uh, so... All I have to get is, uh, and I got some of the rares for unhinged and uh, unglued. So um, over time, I'll, I'll uh, continue to build them up and um, continue to build them up and uh, and uh, put them together. But uh, for now, I'll, I'll have a cube started, and uh, we can play with the unsets um, and. Uh, so, but uh, I hope you enjoyed everything. Um, I'll show you the mythics one time, one last time. Uh, hard hat area, Urza's headmaster, summon the pack, and our only rare an augment to an host. Augment for three whenever you land enters the battlefield under your control and the other half will have something else. So um, just for for instance, let's see if I have a good good host. I'll show you what a little bit what that looks like. All right. So say we have mother kangaroo. And then you, of course, you play this first. And then uh, with this on the battlefield, you can pay three and augment it. You'll get a serpentine kangaroo. Whenever a land enters the battlefield under your control, roll a six sided die. Put that number of one one counters on this creature equal to the die result. So this is would it is amazing on, on uh, Mother Kangaroo. Um, basically, almost every. Every turn, you're getting a uh, you're get to roll a six sided die and put counters on it, so that that is an amazing amazing thing. But and uh, as I posted earlier on um, from an article from Star City, that these cards are are commander legal un until I think it's uh, January fifteenth. So. Um, and that is something I'll probably be doing is making a commander deck for moms and uh, come down and uh, play it. But uh, it'll be fun to make uh, a commander deck out of uh, out of the unsets. And uh, that's probably something I will be doing. And uh, the box of unstable that I'll be opening a little bit later and uh, posting uh, is from Channel Fireball. And... Uh, so hopefully, I don't know, maybe we get a god box and get foil lands in every pack. Um, I hope that's something that happens, but uh, I don't know. You know, people say with my luck, I probably will get it, but uh, my heart says probably not. But uh, hopefully you enjoyed the video. 
um, foil, foil uh, tokens in every pack is uh, really awesome. Just uh, a little thing about that. Um, these are only, uh, the silver borders are only to be used in, in un, the unset. Um, and uh, the, the black borders can be used uh, for anything outside of the unsets, um, pretty much. Um, but I don't know, maybe this... Uh, this token may become a black border later on because I think they have a couple of courts from the unsets that have made uh, sets and um, this court in particular um, is not overpowering I don't think um, maybe it is but uh, maybe they do put the that court in a, a set sometime and uh, but the reason I'm buying Unstable, to be quite honest with you, is for the lands, because I think they're absolutely beautiful lands. And um, I want to get sets of all the lands, at least 20 of each one. So I'll be buying a little more and a little more. But I uh, hope you enjoy the video, and uh, we'll see you back later, a little bit later. And I will uh, show you uh, a box of Unstable. So... Until then, this completes another episode of The Timmy Show, and we will see you back later.